add something like uh, tangent of arc cosine of two-thirds. All right, I'm tempted actually to draw a triangle. Yeah, that's what we were For this. Um, but I've got this nice picture of a circle mm -hmm. on the screen, so might as well use it. Okay. <laughs> right? Uh, so two-thirds is an x-coordinate, because this is cosine. Mm -hmm. So two-thirds is like right here. Yeah. Okay. So arc cosine of two-thirds apparently is telling us we're handling one of these triangles. Mm -hmm. Right? So they probably tell you something about uh, where you are in the unit circle. I guess not, because we know that arc cosine uh, for sure is only... lives up here. Yeah. Right? So as written, we're concerned with this triangle. Yeah. Okay. So there you go. There's the <laughs> there's the answer. Um, probably not so helpful. But uh, when I say there's the answer, I mean there's your line, and it's the slope of that line. Mm -hmm. Right? So what do we do to figure out the slope of that line? We can write in a two-thirds. Okay? Um, evidently, though, we need to know uh, what this distance is. Uh-huh. Right? So how do I figure that out? Um, we could, well, you know that um, that length is 1, because the radius... Uh -huh. So when you're pointing to that length, we mean... This length. This thing. Yeah. The red length is 1, the blue length is 2 thirds. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... This is 1. Mm -hmm. 2 thirds, and then I guess it's a good thing to label this with it would be y. So we have y squared plus 2 thirds squared equals 1. Yep. Right? Did I do that right? Mm hmm. Okay. Uh, it's, we got root 5 over 2. Um, mm, uh, I'm not ready to do tangent. Okay. This is sine. Oh, okay. Right? So, um, what we've just figured out, though, is that sine of arc cosine of two-thirds, that's what this is. Mm. That's what we just figured out. Okay. Right? Now, like you said, if I want to figure out tangent, um, as much as oh, it okay. pains me to do so... I will now divide, um, so tangent of arc cosine of two-thirds um, is equal to sine of arc cosine mm -hmm. of two-thirds. Over cosine. Over cosine, now I'm being a bit obnoxious, um, with writing all this out, mm -hmm. but um, the bottom is just two-thirds. Right. Right, and the top is so this is what root 5 over 3 divided by 2 thirds, which is root 5 over 2. Yeah, okay, perfect. Um, let's do it with triangles, okay? Okay, okay, so that unit circle thing is probably totally not how you do it, right? In class, yeah, it's not. Um, so you do something like arc cosine of two-thirds. Uh, you probably draw a triangle. And the triangle probably looks like... So if this is theta, mm -hmm. then our triangle probably looks like this. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. um, now what? Uh, okay. Square root of... So this is root five. Yeah. Okay tangent of theta equals root 5 over 2. Mm -hmm. So that's like the quick and easy path yeah. to the answer. Um, now, we the reason why this is so quick and easy is because we are not concerning ourselves with which quadrant mm. this angle comes from. Mm -hmm. um, a more difficult question could tell you something like uh, 
a more difficult question would say um, if cosine of theta equals two thirds, okay, then and um, tangent of theta is negative, okay, mm -hmm. then sine of theta equals, right, and the answer would be negative root 5, whoops, negative root 5 over 3, okay. for example, okay. Um, another thing that I don't like about the triangles is, uh, what if I tell you that tangent of theta equals 3 over 4? Mm -hmm. What's sine of theta? Um, um, uh, it would be... Um, three over five. Okay, so you are not, I can't fool you. Um, so what happens is, I mean, of course you're not going to mess this up because you're, you know, you can figure out sine of theta is three-fifths in your head, mm -hmm. then uh, you're not the audience for this lesson. <laughs> okay. But um, what you'll see is this. Okay, and this is just bad, bad, bad. Mm -hmm. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. How this could happen yeah. if, in a momentary yeah. lapse of reason. Um, but, nevertheless, mentally were you drawing this triangle? Yeah. Um, you were saying three, three four, four five. five? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Um, so that's good. Uh, 